Yo, what's good? Welcome back to Mega Man The Wily Wars. Uh, we are back with the second half of Mega Man 2, where we finished the Robot Masters, and now we are on to the Wily Sages. Um, and I, I, I did realize that uh, since the last part, I did turn off my pocket. So, I don't think I have all those lime all those limes, lives that I farmed uh, in the previous part. In Woodman Stage, I grinded up to nine lives, so I, I'm i probably back down at two. So let's, let's double check that. Um, hopefully I still have my E-Tanks. I think this game saves E-Tanks, which is pretty nice. Uh, okay, we got our E-Tanks, awesome. We are at two lives, alright, well... Do I want to farm some lives? Let's, let's farm a little bit of lives. Oh, there's one. It's a good start. Also, this song is legendary. It's not as good as the NES one, but you know. Wily Sage 1 and 2 is one of the best video game songs of all time. It's a good song, but it's a little overplayed. Just a little overplayed. Um, I'm at 3 lives. Let's try to get 5 lives. Or better yet, I'm, I'm gonna uh, jump cut it once I get 5 lives. Alright, we're good to go now. Good to go now. We got five lives. Good to go now. Good to go. Alright. So these Wily Sages, they, I think they kind of make you use the uh, three items that you get throughout the game. Um, so it's important to keep those items at like a healthy... Uh, weapon tank, essentially. You want to make sure you, you have weapon energy to use them. Oh, come on. I'm already running out of that. Uh, you know, I think I'm good on lives. I don't want to risk running out of too much energy. The Metal Man ability is pretty fine, though. It, it's it's amazing how much energy you have with the Metal Man ability. The Metal Man ability, in general, is just so ridiculously overpowered in this game. The fact that you can, like, angle it, like, diagonally, like, look at this. This thing's crazy. And I think like, what, three or four bosses are weak to this thing? It's such a crazy ability. Okay. So this is going to be the first boss of the Wily Sages. It's weak to the Boomerang, I'm pretty sure. You're going to have to do some crazy platforming. Oh boy. Try to stand close to the left side of the edge in case I get hit. Oof, there we go, that was close. <clears throat> but yeah, my trick there is to stand close to the left side of that block, so... 
if or when you do get hit, you kind of recoil back and you don't just fall off. That's kind of the main hazard for that fight. You don't want to get hit and then fall off from that hit. Stage number two. Um, what needs energy? Item three or item one? I guess it doesn't matter. I'm stretching my fingers real quick. Uh, let's power up item. Two item three. We're gonna be using item two right now. Okay. Uh all right. E-Tank. That's our third E-Tank, which is pretty cool. We're getting a lot of lives, too. We, I don't even think we really needed to farm any. And are we at... I think we're going to be at four E-Tanks. Um, yeah, four E-Tanks. Cool. So we are good to go. farm here if we need to. Do we need any more? Um, need anything else? <clears throat> oh, we should probably get this max. I think for Wily Stage 4, we're gonna need uh, the Clash Crash Man ability. We need that to be max. That boss is really stupid. It's like Beta Chaos stupid. Dude, what the heck, man? Ooh, another life, dude? I actually need some health. I'd like to make sure I have full health before moving onward. This hallway kind of sucks, doesn't it? I definitely need to have full health. Oh, man. Dude. These seeds are gonna kill me. Before I get like a big health drop, man. This is crazy, they're not dropping any health. This is one of like the big problems I have with Mega Man in general, is like, I feel like at any point with any of the games you're gonna be doing some grinding like this. There we go. I can't even dodge that one. Dude, come on, man. I swear these things are harder to kill than, like, in the OG Mega Man 2. On the NES. I think in general these games might be harder than, like, the NES ones. Like, you couldn't use the, the pause trick on the old Devil in Mega Man 1. I wonder if the pause trick is going to work for the Wily Stage 4 Sentinel boss, or whatever he's called. So for the Wily Stage 4 boss, there's a uh, there's a trick you could do to like pause and unpause the game. 
to avoid getting hit, which I'll probably try to do, but I don't know if I don't know if it's gonna work or not. Cause when you pause and unpause in this game, I don't know if you have any like uh, I don't know if you have any invincibility. So that's kind of a problem. Now we might have to burn an E tank on that boss. Alright. Oof. Uh, we're gonna need to use Metal Man's ability. Oof. Oh boy. GG. GG. Shake my hand. If that boss hits you, it does a good amount of damage. Probably like a fourth of your health or something. You could probably take like four or five hits from that guy, so I didn't want to risk. I didn't want to risk going in there without full health. Just in case I get like Mickey Mouse damage or something. <clears throat> All right. Uh, I don't need any E tanks, so we're good. Otherwise, I would have used item one up there. Used item one to get up there and then clash bomb. I think we're good. We are good. Uh, do I need this? Dude, I suck at jumping. Okay, you get the heck out of here, dude. Thank you. Um, okay, what do I want this for? I guess Metal Man's ability. And then for this, we need this to be at a hundred percent. But I guess we can wait till the next level. Let's, um, let's make sure we have item three. There we go. Just in case. Dude, that fish always looks so goofy, man. I think it's like the only time you see that fish, too. Ooh. Okay. This feels like a Kaizo Mario section. See, how are you supposed to avoid getting hit from that dude? I think that's my I think that's my problem in general with this game is like I feel like there's a lot of situations that you just like can't avoid. It's like or like maybe you can avoid them, but it's just worth getting hit. Especially with those um those enemies on the on the what is it those sniper joes on like the walkers on like the legs or whatever. Oh, this dude's weak to the boomerang. Right? Oh, this guy's a joke. That guy's a joke. I think Gutsman was harder than that thing. This next boss, though, sucks. I really hate this next boss. It's just like a gimmick fight, pretty much. And you gotta make sure you have... You need to make sure you have full Crash Man ability, and you gotta make sure you have item 1... Item 3? I don't think item 2 helps. Um, okay. 
<clears throat> well, let's make sure we have item 2 anyway. Um, good on everything. I think the boomerang's fine. Let's just get... Let's make sure we're maxed out on item 1. Yeah. As great as Metal Man's ability is, we could be fine without that maxed out. <sighs> what the heck, dude? How many lives do I have, anyway? Eight? We don't need that life, we're fine. I just don't want to run out of lives, that doesn't sound great. Uh, okay, so the gimmick here is that there's invisible floors. Um, I think the trick for this is to use Bubble Man's ability, so we can see where the holes are at. There we go. Uh, we don't need that E-Tank, otherwise we'd grab it. If we started this with zero E-Tanks, we'd probably grab the one on the previous level and then that one, but we're fine. Um, that would give us four E-Tanks, which is nice, but we already got four, we're good. We are good. Uh, this room sucks. The stream is not too hard once you get it, it's just more tedious and, like, boring. <laughs> just gotta wait for this platform, pretty much. Well, I'll take that. Yeah, buddy. I think we use item 2 there. Or maybe we don't have to, but I am. Fly across this. Alright. Oh god. Yeah, these. So. This, these are the enemies I was talking about. These enemies, like, you just. Get hit by their bullet and then just run past them. Like, they're not worth fighting at all. Either of these guys. Just, like, run past them. And that's. That's gotta be like one of my biggest problems with this game. How did he miss me? Excuse me? I was trying to get hit by his bullet so I wouldn't lose too much health, but alright. Oh man, okay, this sucks. Well, I'm probably gonna have to burn an E-Tank for this fight. After that. Yeah, this fight is like literally one of the worst bosses like, ever. There's a lot of slowdown though. Hopefully that kills the th guy in the wall. Yes, cool, cool, cool. If I can, I'm gonna try the pause trick. Ugh. Oh man, you know, I'm gonna have to burn the E-Tank. I really don't want to, but... Let's do it. This fight is just so... It's just such a bad fight. I don't like this fight. Okay. Man, I... The timing's so weird. I can't even try the pause trick. Ah! Come on, dude. Okay. Oh, man. That fight sucks. That fight really sucks. So if I would have missed... Man, if I would have missed... Um... One of those crash bombs... Then I would... Pretty much if you miss a crash bomb, you can't beat him. I was able to do the twofer where I blew up the wall and 
killed one of the things. But, like, that just gave me, like, an extra shot. Um, how's my weapon power? I think I'm good. My crash bomb is gone, but I don't think I need that as much. My eight lives. We have three tanks. I don't like that I had to burn a tank, but whatever. I think we'll be okay. This guy's weak to metal, man. Dude. Get out of here. I think three or four bosses are like weak to metal, man. It's pretty stupid. It, it literally makes no sense to me. Like, how come Metal Man literally dies in two hits to his own ability? <laughs> it's so stupid. Uh, this guy's weak to Air Man, right? Because he jumps around. Yeah. Boom. Easy. Uh, which one's this? Ugh, Quick Man. Let's get him down to half health first. Alright, Quick Man's not easy at all. Can you get away from me, dude? Dude! I'm pretty sure he doesn't have a weakness other than Flashman. The, uh, time stop. I don't want to burn a freaking E-Tank on this dude if I don't have to. Oh, dude. Get out, get, like, get out of my character model, dude. Like, what are you doing? I'm gonna die again, man. Yeah. This dude's ridiculous. He just keeps walking into you. <clears throat> um, we have... We got six lives. Let's try not burning an E-Tank. I really don't want to burn an E-Tank on this fool. Look at this guy. Quick man's no joke, dude. Bro. Let's do Ooh, the freeze. If I gotta burn an E-tank, I'll burn an E-tank. Okay. <laughs> Alright. We don't gotta burn an E tank, that's good. Um Who's this? Bubble Man? Um he is weak to Metal Man probably. What the okay. Um I'll just let him kill me. I don't know what the heck happened there, but whatever. Let's get her health back. Let's just get her health back. Oh my god. I don't know why, like, the controls just feel so weird. There we go. Um... How many more? Three more? What's this? Woodman? What is he weak to again? I think Airman? He's weak to Heat, but I'm gonna save that for Wily. Now, Woodman is Airman. Woodman's good to Airman. Um, I think it's... He's weak to Air. Right? Yeah.
That hit me. Oh god, man. Dude. Ooh. Thank goodness for that. Okay. Um, I think Heat Man's easier. I feel like Heat Man is on top. Let's try getting Heat Man. Okay, I think I can beat him without getting it too much. Okay, we're good. Um, and then Woodman is good for Airman, who's last. Okay. <laughs> ah! Dude. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna. How many lives do I have? I'm gonna play it safe. I'm gonna burn a life, get full health, just in case I screw up anything. That's kind of the nice thing about having a bunch of lives, is you can kind of just do that. Uh, Woodman, okay. I also forget how much weapon energy these wood shields take. Uh, dude. Dude. Get out of here. <laughs> Alright. Now we fight Wily. Let's burn an E-Tank. Ooh. Ah, what is he weak to in this form? Might be Clash? Bruh. <laughs> Whatever, man. These E-Tanks gotta go somewhere, dude. Not done yet, though. We have one more section. But I don't think a section's too bad. I think it's just... I think you just dodge some, like, droplets, and then you fight final boss, which isn't as hard. Dodge some, like, random drops, right? Yeah. I think these do a good amount of damage, though, so I don't want to risk, like... I want to take my time. I'll be patient. Uh, okay. I'll wait for each droplet if I have to. I don't want to... Uh, I don't want to mess it up, man. Uh, ooh, ooh, ooh. <gasps> oh, like a, four, a fifth of my health, man. It's not too bad, but it ain't too good, either. Uh, and we're gonna need Bubble Man. <sighs> okay. Final boss. This is a pretty cool final boss, so I'll, I'll say that. It's like a cool, lame final boss. Can I only shoot one? I can shoot two. There's like a lot of lag though, man. Dude.
This lag is crazy, man. Dude. The lag is honestly making this fight a lot harder. This is crazy. Dude, I can't afford to miss this. There's an insane amount of lag. Oh my god. Oh. Dude, how much health did that just take away? I ran into him and it took away like... 70% of my health? 75% of my health? That wasn't his bullet, was it? I think that was actually hitting the dude. That could have been really scary. Ooh, okay, well. I'm very happy to have that game over with. The credit scene is pretty cool for this game, too. My man with that gangsta walk. Look at this man. Such a cool ending. I've always like liked this ending. Go through all the seasons and stuff. sick. I was gonna take a picture of that. <laughs> I was gonna take a screenshot of that in my pocket. Metal Man. So yeah, that's it for Mega Man 2. Um, you know, I don't really know what I think about this game. Like, it's a classic. It's regarded as, like, the best Mega Man or one of the best Mega Mans. I don't know, man. There's, like, this game is, like, more unbalanced than the first one. With, with Metal Man's ability being, like, supremely dominant and, like, um, Wily Stage 4 boss is a pain. Uh, like, the fact that you need to make sure you have Item 1 or Item 3 and Crash Bomb, you know, is just kind of stupid. Um, I don't know. Like, overall, this is, to me, it's still a great game, but I, uh, I'm probably, like, one of the few people that, like, actually, I think I kind of prefer Mega Man 1. I don't know if it's out of nostalgia, or, like, I just feel like Mega Man 1, I mean, what did I, like, my, my big complaint for that was, like, the magnet beam, you know, how you kind of have to do Guts Man, and then you go to Elect Man, and then you gotta make sure you have the magnet beam, like, weapon power. But, I mean, that's really it. The bosses are, are fine. Um, I think Wily Stage 3 in Mega Man 1 could be an issue. If you run out of Gutsman's power, maybe? In, in general, I think it sucks when a boss, like, just becomes unbeatable when you don't have the weapon energy.
presented by Capcom. But yeah. Mega Man 2, done. I think both this this game and Mega Man 1 are great. Um, I think I s slightly prefer Mega Man 1 over Mega Man 2. You know, probably a very unpopular take, but whatever. Um, and yeah, next up, we'll be tackling uh, Mega Man 3. So if we look back at our file, we got all clear. Mega Man 1, Mega Man 2. And next up, we're doing uh, Mega Man 3. So yeah, thanks for watching and stay tuned for uh, the next part.